Oh my god, what is this? What is this gecko? This New Zealand green gecko, with its bright and vivid colours, its green coloration, and its arboreal lifestyle. It's been a dream of mine my whole life to keep these in captivity, and now it's happened. But why this and why now? Well, I'll tell you why. It's because it's endemic to New Zealand. It lives at the bottom of the world. It's a protected species. It's a vocal communicator. It lives for a long time. It's diurnal. It gives birth to live young. It's arboreal. And it eats insects and nectar. I want to show you the appreciation of this incredible animal. So, what's next? Well, let me show you. It's slow. It's tactical, and it's cryptic in its movements. It knows what it wants. The fly. You can see it appearing, can't you? It took forever, but it's how slowly he has to move. Breath by breath, limb by limb, he gets closer every second. He has way more patience than I do, but it goes to show that if you want something, you'll work hard for it. The fly makes a critical error. It actually jumps closer to the gecko. They're not always successful. They're learning. You see, these two are juvenile New Zealand green geckos, and they're still learning how to hunt. They're not going to leave today without nothing. They're still going to get some enrichment. I place it strategically around the enclosure so that they can search for it and they can find it. They know me, I know them, and they know when they're going to get honey. You see, these geckos consume nectar in the wild, and I'm doing my best to replicate its natural behaviour as much as I can. Even my nocturnal geckos will come out during the day for a treat. But the moral of the story is, the gecko will get the fly. Don't worry. So what's next for me and these geckos? Well, I'm going to watch them grow, I'm going to feed them, give them the enrichment they need, and enjoy the species in captivity. I'm Max. This is a New Zealand green gecko. And I hope this has inspired you. Or at least shown you how incredible these animals truly are.